People powers prevailed in Sippy Downs with governments joining forces to improve the safety of local school children. Currently, the walk to school for many students is a deadly one. Every morning and afternoon, Sippy Downs school children come within inches of their lives. I won't even let my own kids walk this road because of that danger factor. Hundreds of students walk this stretch along Claymore Road each day, so much so a goat track's been forged into the dirt, but soon kids will have the pleasure of walking on a real pathway. The state government has agreed to contribute the final piece of funding. Because it's one thing to have the funding, but it's another thing to actually start construction. That's what we're really interested in, and having that construction start as soon as possible. Council and the state government have jointly funded the $1 million pathway project. Yes, it should have been delivered when the road was built, but um, that, that has happened and uh, now we're moving forward positively. It's a real win for people power. A petition was tabled in Parliament. If council can't afford to do it, we need the state government to pitch in, hence we had a petition, 700 people signing the petition, and uh, the state came to the party, so it is a great outcome for the Sippy Downs community. 